Hey, what's going on guys? It's ETA Prime back here again. Today I am back with the Odroid XU4 and I also have the Raspberry Pi 3. I want to see how they both perform within Ubuntu Mate 16.04. We're going to run Sysbench on both of them. The first test is going to be a single threaded test and the second test is going to be four threads. Then I'm going to move on to some browser benchmarks. We're just going to do SunSpider and Octane. I did want to test out YouTube playback on both of them. Now, both of them run YouTube really crappily, but I recorded about 20 minutes of footage on the Odroid running it in Chromium, and then I couldn't get Chromium to launch on the Raspberry Pi 3, so I figured I'd cut that out and make another video later on. I wanted to keep everything as fair as possible between these two boards, so I'm using the same exact type of SD card. It's a Class 10 Samsung Orange 16GB SD card. Same keyboard, same power outlet, same ethernet cord. I tried to keep everything the same between the two of them. Let's get right into some benchmarks. So here's the Sysbench scores for the single threaded run. Odroid is going to be on the left and the Raspberry Pi is going to be on the right. Lower is better with this test. And as you can see, the Odroid is much faster. This is the four thread test. And again, the Odroid is much faster. Now here's a SunSpider test, lower is better. Using the same browser, this is Mozilla Firefox. And again, the Odroid takes the win. I ran these tests three times, and here's Octane. We have a much higher score with the Odroid. Even though the Odroid XU4 is much faster than the Raspberry Pi 3, it doesn't make it a better board. The development for the Raspberry Pi 3 is going to go on for years to come, and we never know if the XU4 is going to be supported for the next six months. That's the big issue when it comes to single board computers. If you want to get into something, I definitely suggest starting out with the Raspberry Pi 3. If you want something a little more powerful to mess around with, grab you an XU4. It's definitely worth it to me. I love these little boards. And overall, I love the XU4. There are a lot of operating systems for it. There's obviously more stuff going on for the Raspberry Pi, but the Odroid has its own little corner, and it's holding its own against the Pi right now. I really appreciate you guys watching. I got a lot more coming up, so stay tuned. Hit that like button if you could, and like always, thanks for watching.